Allison Williams began attending Reddington Christian Church about a decade ago. Three short months later, she was taking the lead on the youth ministry program. So it's only fitting that here at the church she loved so much that her life will be celebrated on Thursday. And initially when he was talking to me, I didn't really comprehend that she had passed. And I had to ask him, because um, it just wasn't, it, it just didn't click. It just didn't seem that that was possible. A doctor delivered the news to Pastor Scott Brown Monday. Not long after bringing his friend to the emergency room, she was gone. Only days before, 36-year-old Allison Williams had been diagnosed with the flu. In my 34 years of ministry, she's the best youth minister I've worked with. She also became a cherished friend during the 11 years Williams served alongside Brown at Seymour's Reddington Christian Church. He said Williams was incredible at reaching the church's youth, and during her time there, there's some things that come natural to each of us and some things we have to work really hard at. And for me, prayer is both. Williams grew the youth group from about a dozen to nearly 100. In her office, which is painted bright orange for the Tennessee Vols, she hung up this sign. And truly, she was the one to make a difference. Every year, she would obtain all of the kids' schedules for extracurricular activities, whether it was band or choir or sporting events. And she made an effort to go to every kid's event at least twice during the course of a year. Her life, thanks to those kids, was rich, and her faith, Pastor Brown said, was deep. A faith she not only shared, but grew. And that, he says, will be William's legacy. If they